Enjoy your life as a carrot, Vegetoid. I think I saw a ghost. There's a ghost down there. You again? I don't want to deal with you. You're easy work. Hello. At least that's a couple. That's a. It's a couple uh, gold pieces. I fell down a hole. Now I can't get up. Go on without me. Wait, ghosts can fly, can't they? Oh well. There's another veggie toy over there. Let's go and see what he has to say. The same thing. Oh, we know how to deal with this one. Offers a healthy meal. Eat your greens. Where's the greens at? Oh. Oh. Oh, my health is way too low. I can't really get hit much. My health is already low, and I'm definitely... I Imagine if I die now. Oh, no. Four. Okay. It's yellow. My health is at four. That's crazy. Let's go ahead and heal. Very unlicorice like. Okay. The far door is not an exit. It simply marks a rotation and perspective. What's this? It's a switch. Press it? Yes. Okay then. What about this? It's a switch. Yes. Nothing. Okay. Look, I know I know you like to dance, but I'm not in the mood for dancing. The switch press it yes I nothing happened okay so they did nothing oh of course I fell oh my gosh can you relax You noticed there was a blue switch behind the top. Of course there is. There we go. If you can read this, I already did that. You're a little late. If you can read this, press the red switch. Just making sure there's not a switch to Vegetoid. Vegetoids? Oh no. This could be bad. Come on. Okay, good. Made it through. One of them is... Spare that one. Look at that. My skills are improving. Eat your greens. Give me the greens. Oh, I missed it. Alright, he's not ready to surrender. Where's my greens at? Oh. Still not? Maybe one more? Oh, that was close. Okay, there we go. Look at that master, it didn't even get hit a single time. Red switch. There we go, worked. If you can read this, press the green switch. There's no, uh, it's probably hidden. There's no one to spare, right?
Oh, oh, this isn't good. I need to do I need to do something here. Oh, oh, please, please don't. Please don't. I'm dying. <laughs> For hell. <laughs> I'm dying. Please. Please let me be. Oh. I don't know what to do. One more time. Come on. Okay, come on, lock in. Oh, that's not good. Oh, barely. Thank you. Well, a single hit and I'm dead. Oh, thankfully I made it out of there. Yes. Already, already clicked it. Please have a saving point. Come on, please. Oh, which way do I go? Oh dear, that took longer than I thought it would. How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? Who did this to you? You will get an apology. I should not have left you alone for so long. It was irresponsible to try to surprise you like this. Er, well, I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Come, small one. Is there a save point? There is. Seeing such a cute tidy house in the ruins gives you determination. Alright, that should have healed me also. Because I wanted to go check this uh, this side out. A frog it? Ribbit, ribbit, just between you and me. I saw Toriel come out of here just a little while ago. She was carrying some groceries. I didn't ask what they were for. We're all too intimidated to talk to her, ribbit. Okay. Oh, wait, a knife? Toy knife? Oh, nice cozy house you got here. Do you smell that? Surprise! It is a butterscotch cinnamon pie. I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here. So I will hold off on snail pie. Snail pie? I don't want that shit. Here, I have another surprise for you. Take me to it. This is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. But... I barely know you, lady. And you're offer offering for me to live here? That's crazy. Is something burning? Um, make yourself at home. You have seen this type of plant before, but do not know its name. Alright, interesting. An empty photo frame. It's really dusty. A box of kids' shoes in, a dis in disparity of sizes. The song changes. She did she leave me a pie? I think she left me a pie on the ground. You found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie. Good. I'm sure that'll come in handy. They don't interest you at all. Well, this isn't my home. I'm being kidnapped. It's Toriel's diary. Read the circle passage. Uh, nobody tell Toriel. You read the passage. Why did the skeleton want a friend? Because she was feeling bonely. That was an awful joke. The rest of the page is filled with jokes of a similar caliber. 
Well. Inside the drawer are flower seeds and some broken crayons. Room under renovations. Alright. Oh, hello, Toriel. Up already, I see. Um, I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. There are so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I have always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still, I am glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? Well, when can I go home? What? This this is your home now. I don't think so. Would you like to hear about this book I'm reading? It's called 72 Uses for Snails. Yeah, I don't really care about that. I wanted to get out of the ruins. How about an exciting snail fact? Did you know that snails make terrible shoelaces? Well, um... I would hope my shoelaces aren't made out of snails. That's all I can really say about that. Interesting. I'm gonna ask you again, Toriel, and you better give me the answer this time. Oh, of course you do. A pie. The size of the pie intimidates you too much for you to eat it. Makes sense. I'm a small -y, a wee little boy. Alright. Let's go down the stairs. Oh, it's dark in here. Like a dark ambiance. You wish to know the, you wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one way exit to the rest of the underground. I am going to destroy it. But you can't destroy it, I need to leave. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now to be now be a good child and go upstairs. I'm not going upstairs. I want to leave. This isn't my home. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come. They leave. They die. You naive child, if you leave the ruins, they, as gore, will kill you. I am only protecting you. Do you understand? Go to your room. Sorry, I'm not going. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. And I am not going. You want to leave so badly. You are just like the others. There is only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Okay then. Alright, so... Talk to her. You couldn't think of any conversation topics. What in the- what in the oblivion is that? Oh, my health just got slammed. That didn't work. Oh my god. <laughs> Please, Toriel, just let me leave. Let me leave, please. Oh my gosh. I'm about to die here. Let me go, please. It, it looks like I'm making some progress. Wait. Her attacks are avoiding me? Takes a deep breath. Look, it's making progress. She doesn't want to hurt me. Acting aloof. Spare her. What are you doing? Attack or run away. I'm sorry, Toriel. I will not. Now let me out of here now. What are you proving this way? I'm proving that I have a heart. 
like me or leave. Stop it. Stop looking at me that way. Maybe, maybe I have to talk to her now? Okay, no. Alright, let's keep sparing then. Go away. How long do I gotta do this? Oh, is that it? I know you want to go home, but... But please, go upstairs now. I promise I will take good care of you here. I know we do not have much, but... I'm sorry, Torio. We can have a good life here. I'm sorry, Torio. I have to go. Why are you making this so difficult? It's difficult for me too, Torio. I have to go. I have to go now. Let me go. I said let me go. Now. Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save even a single child. I do not need your saving. Oh, I understand. You would just be unhappy trapped down here. The ruins are very small once you get used to them. Toriel, do I have to ask you again? I've already tried to spare you time and time again. Don't make me cool. I, it would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I will put them aside. Thank you, Torio. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However, when you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. Aw, she's so nice. Goodbye, my child. Thank you for the pie, Toriel. Isn't she nice? What a nice lady. Alright, this is a little long. Oh, you again. Clever, very clever. You think you're really smart, don't you? No, I'm pretty dumb. In this world, it's kill or be killed. So you were able to play by your own rules. You spared the life of a single person. I bet you feel really great. You didn't kill anybody this time. No, I actually didn't. But what will you do if you meet a relentless killer? You'll die and you'll die and you'll die. Until you tire of trying. What will you do then? Will you kill out of frustration? Or will you give up entirely on this world? And let me inherit the power to control it. I am the prince of this world's future. Don't worry, my little monarch. My plan isn't regicide. This is so much more interesting. Alright, that's an interesting character, right? All right, we're in, we're getting into the world. Undertale. By Toby Fox. Oh, here we go. Alright, a stick, is that a, 
Okay. Well, I saw that. What in... I saw that. You can't trick me. I'm not going crazy. Human. Don't you know how to greet a new per pal? Turn around and shake my hand. What the hell? And that lady was saying that it was gonna be dangerous out here or something. Old whoopee cushion in the hand trick. Oh yeah, funny. Real funny. It's always funny. Yeah, it is. Uh, you're right. You're a human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sans. Sans the skeleton. I think I've heard of Sans. I think it's supposed to be like an important character in the game. I think I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now. But, you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Well, that works out for both of us then. Now my brother, the Pirates. He's a human hunting fanatic. Actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone. Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. Alright. Sup, bro? You know what, sup? Brother, it's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at this lamp is really cool. Do you want to look? Please don't. No, I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Then I, the great Papyrus, will get all the things I utterly, utterly desire. Respect. Recognition. I will finally be able to join the Royal Guard. People will ask to be my friend. I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning. Maybe this lamp will help you. Sons, you are not helping, you lazy bones. All you do is sit and boondoggle. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've gotten a ton of work done today. A skeleton. Alright, I, I see, I see, see I see you, Sans. Come on, you're smiling. I am, and I hate it. Sigh. Why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get some recognition? Wow, sound like, sounds like you're really working yourself. Down to the bone. Okay, sounds like one was enough. I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. Okay, that one was actually pretty good. I liked that one. Okay, you can come out now. You ought to get going. He might come back. And if he does... You'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. Nah, none of us want that. Actually, hey. Hate to bother you, but I, can you do me a favor? I was thinking, my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Even if he tries to be. Thanks a million. I'll be up ahead. Well, alrighty. Ah, save point. The convenience of that lamp still fills you with determination. I think I am going to end it there. It is 2 a.m. And I have work. This evening. So I need to sleep.
Uh, unfortunately. But I will continue this game, everyone. I've heard only good things about the game. And it's old, so... So far, it's really interesting. I'm loving it. The way you can talk your way into fights and spare the enemies instead of fighting them. It's interesting. It's unlike any game I've played, but I'll leave it there. Part 1. And we're going to continue our journey another day. Possibly tonight. Probably tonight. So please like, subscribe, and uh, check out my Twitch channel. Alright, and everyone have a blessed day. Thanks for watching.